guys, what's up? And today we are going to go over solving business problems with currency, in particular currency conversion. So we have this problem over here. Given that one Singaporean dollar equals 0 0.74 United States dollar, how many United States dollars, how many Singaporean dollars is 50 USD, United States dollar. That's just the short form of United States dollar, USD. So there are many ways that we can solve this, but I'm going to set up a proportion because this will always work. So one Singaporean dollar is proportionate to 0 0.74 USD. So if I have 50 US dollars, 50 US dollars, I'm color coding like this, you will see why in just a, in a little bit, is equal to one over, over X number of Singaporean dollars. X is just the number of Singaporean dollars that's equal to 50 USD. The reason why we can make a proportion like this is because the ratio from one to 74 and from X to 50 is always going to remain proportionate. So now to solve, to solve for our variable, what we can do is we can multiply both sides by X. We have to multiply by X on this side, by X. And we have to also multiply by 50. We're multiplying by the 50 so that we can cancel out these two 50s over here. And on this, and if we do something to one side, we have to do the same thing to the other side. So we can multiply by X over here. And we can also multiply by 50 over here. So we have our two X's canceling out like this. Now we have 50 times one on this side, 50 times one. And on this side we have 74 times our, our variable X. So we get 50, we get 50 equals 0.74 X. 0.74x x. so from here we can just divide both sides of the equation by 0 0.74 to get x x is equal to approximately i'm sorry i just switched the sides a bit x is equal to approximately 67.57 and that is our answer now you may have noticed that we could have just done for this over here, we could have just done 0 0.74 times X and one times 50 because in the process of creating common denominators, we just had to multiply by both of the denominators. So like we did over here, 50 times X, X times 50. So now our 50s cancel out, but this variable X remains. And over here, these two X's cancel out the X's cancel out, but the 50 remains. So we can do this technique called cross multiplying where we just go like this. We multiply this part and we multiply this part to do it a lot quicker. 0 0.74 X equals 50. And then we can just solve from there. But I do not want you to just memorize this. Always think about why this technique cross multiplying works before you do it. Okay, and here is a another way that we could have made the proportion we could have solved it like this you can pause the video and take a look at this over here now we have one last problem just for good measure so given that nine Malaysian ringgit is 63.45 new Taiwan dollars how many Taiwan dollars is 379 Malaysian ringgit so again same thing this time I'm not going to do the color coding because I think we've got that 9 Malaysian ringgit is 63.45 Taiwanese dollars. So 379 Malaysian ringgit is equal to X number of Taiwanese dollars, Taiwan dollars. Um, so 9X, we're just doing the cross multiplying by creating common denominators. Equals 63.45 times 379. Let me do that. 379 is equal to 2407.55. Now we can divide both sides by 9 to get x equals, well, x is equal to 2,671.9. So we get 379 Malaysian ringgit is 2,671.9 new Taiwan dollars. Anyways, I hope that you found this video helpful. Thank you for watching and goodbye.